slime. And I call this the toothpaste slime because it's made with toothpaste. Here are the ingredients you will need. Some glue, it can be white or clear glue. Some activator, I'm using borax. Some salt. Some toothpaste, it can be any sort of toothpaste. A mixing bowl. So those are totally optional, but if you want to color your slime, you can use paint or a food coloring, whatever you want. And some glitters, which is also an optional. Something to mix with. And somewhere to put your slime. I'm so excited to see what happens with the ingredients. So let's start. First, take your glue and pour it into your bowl. So I am not gonna pour too much glue inside. Step two, take your toothpaste and pour a little inside. So I pour this much. So I put in this much toothpaste and glue. Next, take some salt. And you can use a little spoon to measure the salt. So I'm gonna pour some on the spoon. This much salt. And then I pour it in. Next, you can take your mixing tool and mix. So as you can see, it's like a really pretty light blue. Make sure that the mixture is well mixed. All right, next you can take your food coloring or your paint. So this is optional, but if you want to color your slime, you can. I'm using a toothpick, so pretty much this much, and I'm gonna put some into my mixture. Maybe a little bit more. All right, this much is good. Gonna put it aside. Then you can mix. And as you can see, it's kind of turning into those purplish color, which is really pretty. I really like this color, guys. Then you can take your glitters, which is optional, and pour it into your slime. So I have those glitters, some pretty pink glitters, and purple ones. So I'm going to start with the purple one. Not going to put too much, so also I'm also going to put it into this little spoon. That much is enough. Then I'm gonna go with the pink one. All right, this much is enough. And the last one, I'm not gonna pour it into the spoon, just gonna go a little bit with this glitter. I'm right, gonna pour this much. Okay, so I don't know if you can see, but I've poured this much glitters. So it's like really pretty all those together, but when I will mix, it's gonna be even prettier. Wow, it's so pretty. It's a little bit like a galaxy color, but not quite a galaxy color. All right, so now is the fun part. You are gonna be taking your activator, and as I said, I'm using borax. And you can take a little spoon, so you can be sure to not pour too much inside. So I'm gonna put like one teaspoon for now. And then you can mix. So as you can see, it's like really cool. It's forming into a slime. I'm gonna put a little bit more inside. Wow, 
Wow. It's really pretty. And when your slime starts to like get stick out of the bowl, a little bit like mine, you can try to touch it, but it might still be a little sticky, but you can just knead it with your hands so it will get less sticky. All right, I'm already gonna touch it. As you can see, it doesn't really stick to my hands, but I'm still gonna mix and add a little bit of borax at a time. Okay, as you can see, it's starting to get together. So I'm just gonna go and try to play with my hands. Ooh, it's really nice. So actually it's not really sticky anymore. So like this, just like this. So I really like this recipe because it's really nice and it also smells really good. Alright guys, as you can see, I've successed my slime. It smells also really good, so I really like that recipe. I recommend you guys trying this. Oh, it's so nice! Can I touch? Sorry Cookie, but it will, it will be too sticky for you. So as you can see, it's really pokey. You can like poke it. And you can also do this. I really like those sounds of slime. Okay guys, I'm gonna do a swirl with it. Like that. All right, I'm gonna put the slime aside in my container. Okay guys, so now I'm gonna show you guys how I made my borax. So it's one teaspoon of borax. If you want, you can buy this borax. It's really cheap. So I'm, I'm using this one and one cup of hot water. So make sure the borax is completely dissolved in the water so you won't have those tiny stuff in your slime. So like your slime is gonna be really stretchy and really nice. And this is how I've made my barracks. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye!